Hello guys. Assalamu alaikum. Today is another day. Actually today is 27 of Ramadan and the month has been busy but um, finally I've got time to make a video. So today's video I'm going to talk about five business you can do this year. And the year is about to reach in the middle. So guys, if you haven't started any business, think about it. So let's get into the video. Okay, guys, first of all, today's video, I'm going to talk about business you can do in this year. Business you should not forget. Business you should think about this year, 2022. That is the business I'm going to share. That is the businesses I'm going to share with you guys. So, those who don't know me, my name is Happy, and my YouTube channel name is Happy Uganda. And if you're new here, make sure to subscribe, make sure to share this uh, video, and make sure to like and make sure to comment down below what you think of my research. And you can also share with us the um, experience you have or if you have ever experienced one of the businesses or if you have ever tried it or if you have ever um, tried something and failed so that is it but okay guys number one on my list is self-care business self-care business here i mean uh, uh, makeup here i mean um nails making doing nails that is my nail studio can i call it nail studio uh here i mean cosmetics here i mean um uh hair doing all that if you can look into the that kind of business it is really really highly profitable almost like every video i do about businesses i don't forget this to remind you people because this business is highly profitable people who have done this kind of business one of the business i've, I've mentioned uh, makeup uh, nail studio cosmetics such kind of things they have not regretted so um so self-care company uh, especially like makeup you can also you can do it from home and you do it online or you can do it or you can open a studio uh, same as nails you can be a nail technician from home or and you become a mobile nail technician you can post your work on Instagram social media you can post your makeup uh, Facebook on Instagram, on Facebook, on like all social media platforms, and people will contact you. And this business, it has given people money. Very many people are successful in this business, especially people who have art in their hands and they can do makeup and they can do nails. They can give out we what this thing of okutabule zigo mixing lotions and creams and people are getting a lot of money so that category really is that does work so think about it because it is always on my number one list number two business i can't forget to tell you guys it's mm, organic honey spices business this is selling of uh, organics like organic stuff that means you'll be selling honey shea butter oils like olive oil coconut oil mm, spices cinnamon cloves all the spices you think about open up this shop think about this business because it is highly profitable as well this business very many people are going healthy are going are trying to go back into a healthy system because we are getting more people who are obese like getting fat so people wants to eat organic and starting up an organic shop it will work for you it will make you it will make for you good money so that is also another business i can suggest for you for this year
Number three, number three, the business I can recommend for you guys is to become an event planner. Event planner here, you can be a decorator, you can be like um, a, a party planners, you plan for the birthdays, baby showers, bridal showers, weddings, all that. Becoming a prana is one of the leading business right now. I think you can see people how they're making money in planning businesses, decorating business, I'm sorry, <laughs> planning weddings and decorating on weddings. Like they get a lot of money. I think the minimum amount given to them is like two million or three million or five million, depends. And even more, more than that. Yeah, people are doing big, mega weddings and uh, baby showers and bridal showers and everything. So becoming an event planner, becoming um, uh, uh, party planners, it is really one of the best business you can think about in this year. Very many people were not in that. I remember when I was still young, we used just to go to to parties <laughs> like Biadi Bivanda, if you can remember, but right now people invest in so much in decoration, in planning events. So think about this business if you can afford it. So, besides and being an event planner. You can also start up a bridal designer. Bridal designers here, you can be hiring commerces, you can be hiring traditional clothes on traditional weddings, you can hire gowns. This business uh, is one of best businesses. Okay, all the, of course, I tell you every business is best, of definitely it's best, and it's highly profitable. Especially now, we are, we are going into the month of june july that is those two months very many women get married in that in those two months june and july so bridal designing bridal gowns anything concerning about briding you can be selling gowns you can hire you can sell maids maids gowns is it, yeah, maids gowns, you can do also makeup on part of that. You can do hair, bridal hair. So this business, it's one of the profitable business in town. In town, you guys, go to Rumu Street, you will see this business is booming. So Rumu Street, those who are in Kampala, they know where it is. It is in Kampala City. So this business is booming and people make a lot of money by hiring the gown someone does, doesn't want to buy a gown because like this is one day only one day you're going to put it on or yeah that is only one day so people prefer hiring others prefer buying so this business is one of the most profitable business this year think about it Okay, guys, some people may think maybe we are for, I'm forgetting those who don't have money, those who don't have enough money. And uh, I was thinking also to guys to give you some idea, most especially guys, especially guys who are still young and don't have money. You can do this business because I've seen it here around my home. Chizungu area, Makinde Chizungu area. They uh, walk pets, dogs, they are walking dogs in the evening. You may find someone has like six dogs and is walking them. And this business is also highly paid. They pay them a, not a lot of money, but enough money for them. Like in the evening, they go to walk dogs for the rich. Or for Mzungu, or for, yeah, yeah, that kind of uh, business is also good. You can walk pets on on your neighborhood, um, and you will get some little money for yourself. 
and those ones who don't have money also and they are living around uh, rich areas even if you're in the ghetto there are some people who do who are very very busy and do not have time to do laundry do not have time to clean the house also if you don't have money and you're thinking of what can i do think about uh, going to do the uh, house oh, sorry think about of going to clean for people's house cleaning their clothes washing their clothes think about um think about that instead of baking money it is better than you going to work for your own money so all that can help you get something for you especially those who do not have a startup those who do not don't know even what to do where to start from yeah you can walk pets you can go to do laundry for other people you can clean their houses all that and it will give you some little earnings to survive your life instead of begging yeah so guys that's it for today and um, i very 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 happy guys thank you for subscribing thank you for watching my videos thank you for your support if you're really really new here and you like this video and you like the information in this video kindly make sure to subscribe down there and kindly make sure to like this uh, to like make sure to share with your friends with everyone um otherwise i wish you all the best and uh, uh, wish, yeah ramadan karim we have few days to finish our ramadan and um, i love you all bye bye